Hey, YouTube. Yeah, again, let me check this mic. I went and recorded this house. I was, was going to post this one on Saturday, but halfway through, the mic died. So I get home, to upload the video, I ain't had no volume. Well, I had volume for like six minutes. But we had it again. We are out here in Covington, Georgia. Say Covington. Well, it say Covington, but we really right here on the edge of Congress. I'm going to come record that one, too. I'm going to come back and get this one. They say they didn't drywall for this one. New construction. We out here in the four wood, uh, what's it called? Four wood subdivision. This house, five bedrooms, four baths, 4,400 square feet. Really big house for it not to have a basement. 4,400 square feet, three sided brick. I don't get the numbers now. That, that I don't get. That's the only thing I don't get. Cause this, like, this is 10. That's 35. And that's 40. <laughs> I don't understand the numbers, but other than that, nice house. It's on point six nine acres. I'm gonna correct myself in the description, but it's on a pretty big lot. I think it goes from the sewer. See how they got their fence to go from the sewer. The backyard not that big because it's on the corner. So go from the sewer down and then come all the way over here. Thank you. Go to the oh. Uh, the little black fence. Three-sided brick, hardy plank, new construction. They still got a little punch out list. The oh, general contractor just left. I met the builder the first time I recorded it. He saw me today, so yeah, you gonna sell this house for me. So well, let me list it, player. <laughs> nah, let me stop for the <laughs> list of agent get upset. I didn't tell him that. <laughs> I told him I'm gonna try to get it sold for record the videos. I just tell him how much I, uh, views I average and stuff like that. So I average 100,000 views a month. So whenever he get them built up, regardless of who listens to them, give me a call. I come out here, record them, shoot them for him. He was like, okay. Because I don't want the listen to feel no type of way. I'm just joking. I'm just joking. You know how people get about their money. This is a luxury new build, new construction luxury build. I had another uh, viewer drove up on me while I was out here. He building a house down the street. Jumped out of the truck. He was like, man, I follow you on social media. He gave me his card. But he'll build it too. I told, now, I told him to send me some listings <laughs> because he ain't had no agent. Like, he's building his own house right now. But when he get back to building houses for everybody else, he'll holler at me. But let's walk in here. House is huge. This right here is your, your dining room. We're we going to come back to this because this... I don't really know what this would be. Like I said, I've seen this house before, so y'all can see the difference of when I've seen the house before and when I be actually walking through it with y'all. Y'all tell me which one y'all prefer. But then you got the kitchen, two car garage. That going here last time? I ain't nothing to show. They got a little room over here. I want a hot water heater over there. Oh, yeah, a little hot water heater over here. But no, I didn't come here last time. Or the heat over here. And then what this is like a storage closet. That's exactly what this is, a little storage closet. Two car garage. All right, let's go back in here. And they got the dark appliances, which I like. But they got the same laundry room. Hand wash sink. I ain't know people still use hand wash sinks and stuff like, I guess baby clothes. They got baby clothes or something like that. People wash their hand. So y'all might need appliances in a minute. I like this different. Smart, I don't think it's hooked up. So it ain't nothing gonna cut on, but this smart convection oven, Samsung. They kind of got it set up like mine. I don't like this. It should have did a different microwave. Don't like that. Samsung stove. Smart, so you can hook that all up to your foot. This is the same refrigerator I got. This is what I was gonna tell you. Same refrigerator I got. Mine's just a little bigger and it's all black. Samsung dishwasher. I got the all black Bluetooth one. So yeah, my they got the kitchen kind of set up like mine with all the Samsung stuff. They should have did the black appliances. I don't know the gray don't look bad though, cause they got the gray countertops. They got the black thing. I don't know gray and black. It look good. It look good with the island in the middle. Got the island in the middle for extra cabinet space. Not cabinet space, but tabletop. Keeping room. 
Now, if you see why I say we got to go back to that, it should keep it wrong. This your family wrong. Because this is the cutout for the fireplace. So this is technically your family wrong. Family wrong, view to the backyard. You put up something in the backyard that's nice to look at. Keep it wrong. So technically, this right here, technically, is your sitting room. But it's so big. I wouldn't make this a sitting room. This would be the family room, and I don't know what I'd do. Well, I know what I would do. <laughs> over there, well, likely I'm have a pool table over there. I know, I know the dude is going to be like, yeah, this man, this pool table. Well, likely this right here, I have a pool table over here. Pool table, a little, little hangout, little area right here. And over here would be my actual family room, because this right here, breakfast table. Well, this be just a table because I don't really need, I don't got no separate table in my house. This be like the living room, family room. I don't know, I might fool around, put the, the pool table in the dining room. I'm a dude, y'all, so it, it's going to be real manly, <laughs> for lack of a better word, if I do it. It's two bedrooms out here. Ah, you know what? I remember. I remember. I remember. This one got the guest bedroom. With the, the sink, because I really like the sink. So, yeah, this is what I was talking about last time, the sink. This is the one with a little flow come off of it. Cool sink. And I really like this. Like, this giving me ideas for my house. I like this. With the tile on here. And then this, because this isn't tile. Well, it's tile, but it feels different. I switched this out. I don't like this. But other than that. Come in here. So that's why in the last video I was telling my how I had my clientele this take them out. They had to take this out. Like people, if one of my clients would get it, this being the contract for them to remove this. Not take the carpet out, but put in new carpet. Because you see the red dirt. That Georgia clay all in the closet. I mean all in the carpet. What is this? Pantry? No, linen closet. You can see. That that might not you can scrub that, but it's still gonna you still gonna see it. They should have waited, put the carpet in until they was finished with everything. So yeah, I had them take that up, add it. I think this is the primary. I can't remember. It's a good thing I see so many houses because I really can't remember a lot of stuff about this house, even though I just saw it like a week ago. Why not even a week ago? Like four days ago, just saw it. So I think this is the primary. Because you got the sitting area over here. Then you got the regular little bed area for the king on both sides. Put your TV up against that wall or this wall. You come into a really nice bathroom. Linen closet. Make sure this mic ain't still on. Okay. Double vanity. When I be saying corny stuff, that's what I mean. It's like little stuff. That it ain't expensive or like extravagant. It's just it adds flavor or like personality to things like corny stuff like that. I would love that. And then I love these right here. I wish the water was on so you could see it and how the water come out. That's so cool to me. <laughs> well, like I said, I like the little corny stuff. I could play them. Okay. Yeah, just look at the inside. Walk in closet. Towel, whole bathroom tiled out, even the closet. They didn't go all the way up to the roof with the tile in here, but I think they are. I know they're not going to go all the way up to the roof out here. Really nice tub. Water closet, as they call it. But here, they didn't go all the way up to the roof, but I think they're going to go all the way up to the roof. I think they're going to tile it all the way up. At least that's what it looked like. I know I know Gene, I'm gonna be like, they should have took it to the roof. But yeah, I think they're going to go all the way up to the roof. They just did. All that's something you can ask for in the contract telling you want the tile to go all the way up to the roof and uh, the shower and the primary. I think this is the primary. We're going to find out. Let's head upstairs. So it's two down here. Say five bedrooms. That means it should be three upstairs. That, I remember that because I like that, but there's no way to get there. Like, how would you get up there unless you got a 34 ladder? I really like that. That is so cool to me. 
but I wouldn't be able to use it for nothing. Like, what could you do? Could you, like, bust a hole and come out with a little walkway? That'd be like a fire office right there. I don't know. I like that. I like it a lot. But I don't know how you would get to it. Okay. Let's see what I remember. I like this, too. Love the little catwalk stuff. Okay. Let's go down here first. Once again, with the carpet. I don't mind the carpet in the bedrooms. I just think they should have waited to put the carpet in. I don't mind this. I like carpet in the bedroom. So this bedroom number three. I think this house is bigger than what they got listed. If I'm remembering correctly, I think this house is bigger than what they got listed. Because you can fit a king in here easy. Nice size bedroom. So this bedroom's pretty big. Both of the bedrooms downstairs was decent size. Yeah, because that's, that's three, four, five. And there's another bedroom over there. So that's a six bedroom house, not a five. Four bath. That's why I said I think they're going to tile it all the way up. So they did it in here. <laughs> I love these sinks. <laughs> I love these sinks. This is bedroom number four. Ooh. I don't know. This might be the playroom for me. Pool table in here. Right here on this side. Gym equipment over here. I'm going to take a picture of my little gym set up so y'all can see what I be talking about. And then you got a closet. So yeah, this is a bedroom. Do we got a window in here? Yep. So this is bedroom number four. So this is a bedroom. So this got a closet. Yep. This is bedroom number five. Oh, I'm going to have to let the owner know they got this listed on. Closet. Pretty big room for the king in here, easy. Yeah, they got this listing on. Listing agent, if you see this, you, your bedroom off. That's five right there. Unless this not a room. No, bedroom number six. That is the primary downstairs, too. This bedroom number six. So yeah, they got it listed as a five four, but it's a six four. Walk-in closet. Oh, the closet bigger than I thought it was. Okay. You feel the king in here. So all the rooms, decent size. They come into the bathroom. Punch out. You know somebody's going to say something when I say the price about it not being completed, but punch out. We're going to do a punch out list. Come in here and finish it out. Anytime we get new construction. Usually people get a new construction before it's completely finished. Usually when you get, if you get a new construction that's completely finished, the person who had the original contract fell through. Either fell through or they backed out or something like that. So that's bedroom number six. Make sure I ain't tripping. That's one, two, three, four. I like that, but I don't know what you, how would you use it? Unless you got a 30 foot ladder? I don't know. That, I, like, I don't know about that one. Y'all gonna tell me about that one. Let me make sure we ain't tripping. So it's four up there. Five, six. Six bedrooms. Six bedrooms, four baths. Okay. Let's put this up. Ooh, I think I want to go this way. I smacked the camera in the lab video. <laughs> it just went crazy. I didn't mean to do that. All right, people. We are in Covington, Georgia. Like I said, this house is actually bigger than what they got it listed as. They got it listed as a five folk, so it's a six folk. All the bedrooms pretty big. House going for six hundred and seventy five thousand. Brand new construction, as you can see, they're not completely finished with it. You get it under contract. All the little punch out stuff, and then there's little stuff in here that you can ask them for, like we're putting brand new carpet down to get rid of the mud, stuff like that. And then the owner is really, really cool guy. Really cool guy. Had a long conversation with him, so look like he's willing to do a lot of things. He was telling me how he retired and this is what he's doing with his retirement. But like I said in every video, like, subscribe, share, comment, tell me your thoughts, give me your opinions, tell me what you think of the price. 
Would you keep the same price? Do you think it's too high, too low, just right? All that good stuff. Give me your honest opinion. Until next time, we out of here. Make sure the mic's still on.